Version 12, Mr. Ng bought 208 t-shirts and shorts altogether. He paid a total of $3,050. Each t-shirt costs uh, $14 and each pair of shorts costs $20. How many t-shirts did Mr. Ng buy and how many pairs of shorts did Mr. Ng buy? Okay, so this question is um, either you do the guess and check method or you do the supposition method. So I'm going to try and do the guess and check first. Okay, so for guess and check, um, there's really no need to draw the table. We just need to write the t-shirts. Okay, and the next thing that we need to guess will be for the shots. Okay, so uh, we're gonna split. Uh, usually the first guess will be somewhere in the middle. So I'm gonna guess there's 104 t-shirts and 104 shots. Okay, each t-shirt will cost $14. Okay, and each shot will cost $20. Okay, what I need to do is I just need to find the total. Okay, since uh, this is a paper too, so you can use a calculator. And um, if you can use a calculator, you should be able to get the answer pretty quickly. Okay, um, in this case, the total will be $3,536, right, which is wrong. Okay, so uh, we are like, we are above the actual amount. So what we need to do is we need to decrease this amount, right? So to decrease the amount, we probably need to increase the number of t-shirts and decrease the number of shots. So the next guess, you always de increase by one so this will become 103 times 20 use your calculator to find out what is the total three thousand five hundred and thirty okay this is obviously wrong but what we want to find is um, the difference okay the difference from the first guess to the second guess is six Okay, which means that every time I increase the t-shirt by 1, the difference will decrease by 6. Okay, so what I need to achieve is I need to reach uh, 3050, right? Okay, from here to here, the total amount will be 3050, it will be $480. Okay, so if you use $480 divided by 6, you're going to find how many times you need to jump. Okay, which is 80. So which means that what you need to do is you need to plus 80 over here and minus 80 over here. So the correct answer should be one oh sorry 185. Okay, and the number of shots will be 23 times 14 <coughs> plus 23 times 20. Use your calculator to check. <clears throat> okay and this will give you the correct answer <clears throat> i'm going to use uh, the supposition method to also do the question <clears throat> okay so we're going to assume that all the uh, 208 items are going to be uh, t-shirts Okay, 208 times 14. It's 2,912. The next step you will need to do is you need to find the difference between the actual amount and this supposed amount. <clears throat> 138. Okay, the next step will be using 138 divided by the difference between the shots and the t-shirt, which is 6. So 138 divided by 6 will give you 23. Okay, so if you assume the t-shirt, the final answer that you will get will be the shots. And usually, um, I'll start off the assumption by assuming the item with the least amount. 
Okay, so once you get 23, basically to find the other item, you just use 208 minus 23. It's going to give you 185. Okay, so you can see that uh, although the supposition method is a lot shorter, but you really need to understand what's going on, you know, in between the steps. If you don't understand, um, I actually drew a model to explain supposition in the earlier questions. Okay, so for part A, part A is the number of t-shirts, which is uh, 185. And shorts is 23. 